Hello, welcome to the TV1 Training Academy studio. Uh, in this video about OneRack, we're going to be talking about how we protect our investment uh, and how we uh, keep our equipment inside the rack nice and cool. Now, the OneRack comes with a series of doors. So this is the fan cover. I think this is going to be the most uh, used door, but we also come with a solid metal door and a Perspex door uh, as well. I want to talk about the fan door in, in some detail if I can. And um, this has been designed to run, uh, uh, give us lots of air through the unit. Uh, it's designed to push or pull air. Uh, and also you can see it's designed with large fans. So this means uh, that it keeps it nice and quiet for the amount of air we're pushing through. Small fans normally equal lots of noise. It's really well designed. Uh, what we do is uh, you can see on the rear I, I have my power connector and we talked earlier about on the power supply how we've got a fan cover here and I'll just use a flying lead between the two uh, then I would connect up and uh, if I want to trim the amount of air that's coming through I've got a pot here so I, I can wind this up and down exactly as I need it uh, even running full out it, it's a, a reasonable volume um, so you can trim that as you want, then you literally screw it to the front. Like I said, we come in three doors, so it could be that if you, if you had, a, um, if you had a units you didn't want to call, um, you could perhaps use the Perspex door. I think that would be popular maybe for home installations. Now the reason we need cooling is it not only extends product life, but it also helps when we're running things like this. And we all know HD based T extenders normally run really warm. So putting them in here, forcing the air through across them will extend your product life. And that's what it's about, isn't it? It's about uh, keeping that rack working uh, as, as long as you can. Um, earlier, we looked at the rear of the unit. And you'll notice on the rear power supply, there's also potential to um, put the uh, put, put the, a fan on the uh, rear, or at least power it on the rear as well. Um, normally though, if I wanted to change the uh, direction of the air, it's really simple. All I do is take this part of the fan unit out, turn it around the other direction, and it changes the direction of the air. Um, so that's uh, how we cool our equipment. Like I said, the big benefit to us is extending the life of the kit. Uh, Hope you like it. If you want to see how we service kit, stick with us. The next video is all about uh, how we perhaps, if we've got a service contract for our equipment, how we use OneRack to help us with that. So thanks for watching. Please watch the next video.